Constructing a box and whisker plot. The following are the ages of 17 music teachers in a school district. 27, 33, 34, 35, 35, 37, 38, 39, 40, 42, 43, 44, 45, 47, 48, 49, 55. Notice that the ages are ordered from least to greatest. Make a box and whisker plot for the data. So if these were not in order, that was what we would have to do first. Luckily, Alex already did that for us, so we are ready to start. So we need to start by finding the median. That's the middle number. So I'm just going to mark off one on each side until I get to the middle. I'm just making a little mark so I can find the middle. I need the, a median is either one number if it's odd number or if it's an even number of music teachers, then I would have two numbers in the middle to add together and then divide by two. So since we have 17, that's an odd number, we come up with 40 as our median number. So our median is 40. <coughs> okay, so then the next step we need to do is to look on this side, all of these numbers on the lower half of the data. That's the lower quartile. So then we need to find the middle number of these eight. So I'm going to just start again marking these off until I find what's in the middle. Because I had an even number, I ended up with two, two values in the middle. Okay, so 35 plus 35 divided by 2 That gives us 35, right? So our lower quartile is 35. Now we're going to do the same thing for the upper quartile. So we're going to mark off again one and one. And I should I should start and follow the same pattern the whole time. But here's my two middles, right? I marked off three on this side and three on this side. So my upper quartile is 45 plus 47, and then divide by 2. That's 46, right? Right in the middle of 45 and 47. Okay, so now I can start to draw. So we're going to just sketch out a little graph. On Alex, of course, it'll be much uh, prettier. Okay, so 40 is the middle, right? That was our median. That was the middle number. And then we need to go up. 2, 3, 4, 5, 46. 46 is over here. And then we're going to go down. 39, 38, 37, 36, 35. 35 is over here. Okay, so those are the ends of our box. So the, the box shows us all of our in the middle numbers, right? We have some that are on this side and some that are on this side, but the main is right here in the box. Okay? <coughs> and then we use whiskers to show the minimum and the maximum values. So our, l our smallest number was 27, that's this one over here, and our greatest number was 55 over here. So then we need to go down to 27, 35, 34, 33, 32. 31, 30, 29, 28, 27. So 27 is down here. Okay, so we're going to make a little dot over here. And then we need to go up to 55. So 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. And we have a dot over here. So here's the whisker. It went up to our highest number over here and went down to our lower, lowest number on that side. Okay, so now we have our box. This was our minimum. This was our lower quartile number. This was the median in the middle. This line right here was the upper quartile. That told us where to stop the box. And then this over here was the maximum. Oh, let me see. I bet you couldn't even see that. Maximum is over here at 55. 
Okay, so on this side, median, and then upper quartile, and then maximum. Now I'm going to go back to the other side. And on this side of our box, we have the minimum and the lower quartile. Now let me zoom out a little so maybe you can see the whole thing. Okay, so that's how you construct a box and whisker plot.